hello everybody hope you're having a really good day welcome to my channel if it's your first time here hit like and subscribe if you enjoy the message for today's reading we're going to be doing a twin flame union energy reading and if you would like a personal reading or twin flame coaching please check the description box below and we can jump in straight away with the first card which is time and tide so you're being asked to ground into a higher state of being which is your natural state of being it's peaceful it's normal it's juicy it's appropriate the divine controls the experience because the divine knows what will feel good we can ground ourselves into this much higher vibration and the next level of challenges comes up to work through yeah, work, work through it by all means, but remember you're already grounding into the higher frequency. You don't have to worry that it's going to be too much to handle. The divine controls our experiences, not us. The divine directs this power and knows how to dish it out. A whirling goddess. The divine is being revealed to you in a whole new way. If your twin flame is afraid at the moment, you don't you don't want to give a hoot about their fears. If they may be scared of you, they may be scared of love, but that's no reason not to share your love with them. Your twin flame cannot be harmed by you sharing unconditional love with them. Bold changes require bold steps. Make sure you're seeing your twin flame being loved by you. Release any overwhelm. Invite clarity and peace. It's the divine's job to present the change and guide you into it. It's just your job to say yes to love. Travel. What's this thing that as you travel within, deeper and deeper into the centre of your heart, that doesn't feel quite in alignment there? Is there any guilt there? Are you afraid that if you ask for love, you'll lose it? Remember, you're worthy of all the love. It's safe to ask for love when you require it. Ask for all the love from the divine in your heart right now. Ask the divine to show you that love. Claim it. That love is for you. So dropping cards here. King of Wands, planets, the Sun, Mars, Jupiter, element, fire, zodiac sign, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, action orientated, friendly, energetic, confident, dependable, protective, charming, hot tempered, controlling, strong, optimistic, passionate, honest, fearless, motivate, strong, funny, proud. Does this deservingness fill your heart right now? Yeah, dump an endless supply of love into your heart. Let any sadness go. What was that sadness hiding? Go deeper. Bring love to all these places. Choose to release all your blocks and feel better. It's safe to be loved because in being loved, you're showing others that they're loved by the divine too. And they're worthy of it too because you're worthy of love. The mirror. Know thyself. Self-examination. Seeing who you really are. And remember as you move forward... That the divine never asked you to pressurize yourself or go through 
difficult experiences or want you to feel guilty, none of that. Love teaches only love. To get love, you want to get rid of fear. And the process feels good. You deserve the good feeling. Love is not hard. Face your fears. Face any deep stuff that's being mirrored to you when you're called to. Resplendent with grace. Yeah, the Twin Flame journey is like a treasure hunt. Treasure hunting all day. You get to keep it. It's a fruitful endeavour. It feels good to do it. The process is rewarding. The result is rewarding. But you do have to give up illusions and fears. It's okay to give up any fears in exchange for all the power in the world. And give up separation from your good. And you will get something good for that. It's safe to fly into the flow of your divinely given power. The divine is beyond question. Claim that power. Your twin flame finds it sexy. Your twin flame's an into power sort of person. It feels good to expand your power. Choose to let your power be limitless. That's what brings you your man or woman. Expansion. There's no need to hide. You show up for love and love shows up for you. It's safe to do that more and more. Helios cycles. The divine created you perfect with perfect intelligence. You have access to infinite intelligence all the time. It's a frequency. Ride the roller coaster. Don't try to run it. How could you ever deviate from perfect intelligence? You remain infinitely intelligent. Choose to claim the truth here. Surrender any illusions not in alignment with that. Choose to see the truth that you are divine. Long distance romance will make your love stronger. It may have been really cool when your twin flame was here. So can't it be cool when they're not here? You think you're without yourself? Are you cool? Your twin flame's not here? You're right here with yourself, which means your twin flame's here with yourself. You're not going anywhere. You can't be without yourself. Choose to accept that you can never be lost. It doesn't matter whether your story is unfolding in a way, was unfolding in a way that you perceived as good, and now it might be unfolding in a way that you perceive as not so good. It's just perception. It's still unfolding. In truth, nothing's changed between now and eternity. Don't be upset about some illusion. Don't give your power to it. Choose peace here instead. Guide, a gut, a mentor, a trustworthy ally. Sometimes you claim your support from the people around you. Sometimes you're your own guru, you're your own therapist, you're your own teacher. Can you hug that part of yourself that still feels separate? Love this part of yourself up completely, don't hold back. How does it feel now to love and have loved that per part of yourself completely? All the answers that you're seeking will soon come. For now, just sit with that peace that you're calling in. See the magnetic power of your self-love and your peace. Let that warm, nice, happy feeling take you deeper You'll feel even better the deeper you go. Divine discontent. Yeah, 
Yeah, please know that you won't be overwhelmed by all your good coming in. It's safe to receive all your good. Do you think that the divine... The Bluetooth device is really too pale. <laughs> Do you think... Sorry about that. Do you think that the divine overwhelms you with her love? No, she just loves and expands all the love just like you. Does it feel good to expand your love? What feels bad is channeling energy into not love. That feels bad. So just keep focusing on love. Always, whatever comes up, just keep choosing love. Keep choosing love. Keep choosing love. Give yourself all the abundance and love that you need. That's the feel good part. Okay, everybody, I'm going to end this message here. I really hope that you enjoyed it and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.